and welcome to the Adventure South Art Project! <laughs> picnic there have a good old chill time and yeah yeah this is the dam we went to back in may but it wasn't open yet for the swimming and now they've opened it and it's really beautiful it's in the mountains it's about 25 30 minutes i think to get yeah. there we've made a little packed lunch yeah see you there <laughs> think it'd be this busy i mean this is middle august people um so everyone comes around to these things people doing some kayaking just you don't show it through the dirt look let's get outside before you show it off honestly <laughs> We've got our food and water next to us. So we've set up camp for the day, which actually brings us on to the sponsor of this week's video, Flextail. The Flextail Tiny Repeller S is a lightweight portable mosquito repellent that can help protect you and your family from unwanted bites while still being able to enjoy the great outdoors. Weighing in at only 5.3 ounces, this ultra lightweight electronic device creates a mosquito free zone of up to 40 feet, making it the perfect electronic repellent for those who love camping, hiking and outdoor living. The Tiny Repeller S also includes a light function with multiple brightness options to suit your needs, including the new breathing meditation mode to help guide deep breathing. We were pleasantly surprised by how bright this tiny device is and have found it very useful on evening walks and especially while watering the garden on late summer evenings. Allowing us to avoid the extreme summer heat while having adequate lighting to see what we are doing without attracting mosquitoes. We also love the flexibility that comes with this Flextail device. Not only is the repeller portable due to its light weight, but also includes several built-in functions that allow you to take it with you and be able to set it up anywhere you go. There is a built-in magnet in the base so that it can be attached to metallic objects, as well as a tripod attachment. However, our personal favourite is the metal carabiner handle on the top. This allows us to attach it to our clothes, rucksacks, branches, and even our fence, allowing our hands to be free while doing the gardening or walking the dogs. 
The tiny repeller S functions by placing the mosquito repellent pads inside the heating compartment. Once switched on, this mosquito repellent can be heated up in as short as 50 seconds to 165 degrees, making it fast acting. There are three modes allowing it to meet your environmental needs, camping mode, outdoor mode, and super mode. It comes with a rechargeable lithium battery and a US Type-C charger, meaning you can charge it almost anywhere. It even has an IPX5 waterproof rating, meaning it can be used in rainy weather conditions. I really like the handy case it comes with, meaning it can be stored easily. It also gives space to store the repellent pads it comes with, as well as the instruction manual and charger. If you are interested in the Flextel Tiny Repeller S, then please click the link in the description box below, and don't forget to use our discount code TSSP15 for 15% off your order. It's actually so beautiful here. You have no clue. You've got windmills in the background, mountain, lake, and everything. It's pretty good. The water looks really blue as well. So I'm, I'm not looking at the camera, I'm just looking around. Like, Whoa. <laughs> These are those mountains that you can actually see from our farm, like way in the distance. We're right on the Spanish border. Mm -hmm. but we've got to get in that water soon. It looks so good. There's also but like... first... Oh, food. We need to have I haven't lunch. eaten anything. Mate, starving. <laughs> There's um, a little area here which is set up so you can bring your own stuff to barbecue and all I can smell is chorizo, like barbecue chorizo in the air and I'm just like, oh, I should have brought some chorizo, man. <laughs> next time, Charlotte. Oh my god, next time. Has to be done. Mm -hmm. It's like a full on like beach. This is pretty much a beach. There's a little pizza restaurant, but they mm -hmm. don't accept cash if you do ever come here. It's card only. Oh, sorry. The other, way, other way, around. way around. They don't accept card. Um, it's cash only. Just a heads up, and there's no cash points around, so bring your cash or bring your own barbecue stuff. Yeah. Yeah. What's, what is this one? It's the Miu Mao. Is it Miu Mao? Um, Miu Moa? May Mao. May Mao. Is that the one we're at? Yes. So there's two in the air, isn't there? I always get confused. There's May Mao, May Moa. We'll, there's loads of it. Oh, it confuses we'll, me. Charlotte's going to leave a writing yeah, somewhere. Yeah, I'll, I'll say what this place is called. <laughs> yeah. I can't I'm hungry. Let's eat. Oh, mate, we've made the packed lunch of kings. Right, lads, I hope you, you're excited for this. Oh I'm excited God. for this. Homemade Thai salad dressing mm -hmm. for our tofu Thai slash Vietnamese style salad. Yeah. It's like rice noodles, carrots, cabbage, lettuce, um, and big chunks of tofu. Like yeah. Carlos makes delicious tofu, covers it all in sesame seeds. So good. Mm -hmm. Then we've got like that's actually a Korean style sort of like smacked cucumber. Mm -hmm. So they're all different parts of Asia. <laughs> but, but it all kind of goes it together. It kind of goes together. Yeah. And then like big chunky slices of melon mm -hmm. for dessert. Yeah, man. Can't go wrong, mate. The only thing is I put the chopsticks with the melon here. So I'm, I have to open that. Yeah, I'm so clever that, <laughs> that you see there's all these, I'll put the chopsticks here. What a here. genius. We didn't bring any plates, but we're just gonna We're just gonna mix, stuff our faces. Mix. No, I'm not being funny. This is so good. Look at that. Made by yours truly. Well, he did the title, but I did the rest. Mm -hmm. um, where's that dressing? We need to pour it all over. Yes. We were trying to be good and not like waste bottles and stuff, but then um, we realised these are really leaky, so we've had to use. We have film. to use. And now I feel guilty. Here's the um, Korean cucumber salad, you know. So good. Pretty good. I'm actually did that on rice and a boiled egg. Honestly, mm. that's all you need. Your soy is made in it. Cool. So this is the salad dressing, right? Yeah, it's like sweet chili. Um, I can't remember. Sweet chilies, sesame, sesame seeds, sesame oil, bit, yeah, soy um, sauce, bit right? of fish sauce, soy sauce. Mm. Right, so I'll just uh, dip okay. this in here. Yeah, man. I could honestly eat that whole bowl myself. Mm. <laughs> we used to have all matching Tupperware, and then we just kept using it to feed the animals whenever they lose their bowls. Literally, <laughs> so is. We, we've been downgraded to ice cream. No, but hey, we love ice cream, sesame seeds. Over the blanket, you silly sausage. My birthday, I can be messy. <laughs> Put your lid on, give it a shake. <laughs> Boom. Sorted. It's actually, look. Yum. See, it's all mixed. No problem, it's all the tofu's fallen to the bottom. No. Oh no. Right, let's eat. Oh, hells yeah. yeah. 
My favourite thing. Mm. Mm. Actually banging. <laughs> I could just eat this all day. Mm. Mixing the salad a bit. Um, I've had all day as a bowl of yogurt. I'm so hungry. Same. <laughs> I've got more snacks for me guys, so. Just for you? Mm. <laughs> fight, 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 fight. Mm. Mm, 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 Lads, time for a swim. We, we've had our lunch, we've had our afternoon siesta, <laughs> as the neighbours say. <laughs> time to swim. It's looking a bit wild. It's looking at the a moment. bit wild, yeah. I mean, <laughs> I gotta put some conditioner and wash it. But hey, if it looks like this, I look cool, so I don't care. Sure, sure. Are your feet all right? Yeah, they're fine, they're fine. If anyone wants to get Carlos a birthday present, get in some rubber shoes. Yeah, uh, if you go to our um, Buy Us A Coffee page and get me some, some slippers, I would appreciate it. <laughs> Thanks, guys. <laughs> Ooh, okay, it's not as warm as the other day, but... Is it really cold? It's not as cold. It's, it's a little bit cooler than the other place. I'm right. It's a bit chilly. <laughs> Should I go for it, lads? Press Leave like. like and comment if you want me to go in. <laughs> Only one way to go in. <laughs> Don't run from there because you'll hurt your feet. Oh my god. Oh. <laughs> right, I guess it's my turn now, isn't it? I can't be taking the mickey out of you and yeah, stand on the Charlotte. edge. Let me take my slippers off. I'm not running in though, I'll trip. <laughs> no, what I'm like. Yeah, it's not that cold, but it's, it's, a little bit cold. it's more that like I can't see where I'm going. It gives me the ick. I don't like things touching my feet. <laughs> <laughs> She's up to her thighs. She's up to her thighs. I don't like that. I can't see what's there. <laughs> Rocks and, and, and fish that can eat your feet, innit? Ah! Come on, babes, you can do it. <laughs> I don't like that. Oh, 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 oh. It's not that bad, but it's like the difference. <laughs> Once you're in, it's all right. Oh. Acclimatise, acclimatise, acclimatise. You're all right. She's only done it, lads, innit? <laughs> She's in. I just don't like touching the bottom of the <laughs> I mean, instead of sand, it's just rocks, isn't it? Yeah. It's just all right. <gasps> She's in. <gasps> She's in. Can <laughs> you touch bottom? Oh, yeah. Yeah, easy, easy. <sighs> easy, babes. <laughs> She's in, lads. She's in. She's in. <laughs>
right, lads. If you come swimming to this beach, just don't do don't what I did. Still. Don't lay Don't stand in the still because you'll find leeches. So here's one. <laughs> it's trying to. Ow! Carlos had two in his boat. Yeah, it's going to bite you if you leave it. <laughs> but yeah, I had leeches all over me because I was like standing still. So I have to go I wasn't check too my. Because um, I kept moving. Yeah. I had a couple, but you you had you had two in his belly button. I know. Awfuls. <laughs> Oh, still got some on my feet. Oh, oh, she still has some. Oh my goodness. The bananas, yeah. Well, they they they're only like tiny. Then then they're not even the size of my thumb. Perhaps but. use a swim pool where we were like it's too busy. But yeah. I think we'll be doing that next use time. Use that, or just like bring some slippers and just jump in the water. If you're swimming naturally, it's fine. But all right, Charlotte, I will be back hopefully leech free. <laughs> all right, everyone. There wasn't any light, so we'll just have to hope for the best that he's free of leeches. <laughs> Fun fact, don't lay in a beach in the mud. You'll get leeched. <laughs> it's quite funny though. <laughs> I've checked the uh, intimate areas. I don't think there's any, but... <laughs> Happy birthday. Happy birthday, Carlos. <laughs> All right, lads, we've had a lovely time here. We are now... Um, looking at the sunburn, don't mind me. Yeah, she actually, so... It must have been on the car. It took us about 25 minutes. It took us 25 minutes to drive here. She literally got sunburn by not putting sunscreen. You can see the actual tan lines here, look. It is crazy. Yeah. I put it on my face and stuff. I didn't put it on my arms yet. Poor bean. So um, yeah, we're gonna go to Pin on the Court. Oh, yeah, that goes. <laughs> um, as I was saying, um, we are going to drive by Hinamakura. We've never seen the place. We're just going to get yeah, some cash out. Yeah, we've just been past. We've never been in. We did get some cash out so we can go to a party later. Yeah, yeah, yeah. As a little street party, have a little dance. We might buy some stuff and make a little sangria. Our Ooh. cherry liqueur's ready. Yeah, so we so. can do a cherry liqueur sangria for that bit of sweetness, you know. <laughs> We are in Pinamakur. We've never been here before. We're literally winging it. Um, um, so it's like stunning, FYI. It's but pretty I good. I have no idea where I'm going. I think it's going this way. This looks like the right way. Follow the leader. Oh, Bean, your shoulders are looking very red. Oh, no. <laughs> Lads having cheeky refreshments. Mm. So the plan is we're gonna see if the big shop in the bottom um, is gonna be open. We're gonna buy some refreshments. If not, we'll just like have a couple shots of the cherry le le liqueur before the party after we watered the um, the garden. It's not that far away from my house, honestly. So about yeah, 20, 25 minute walk, you know. So yeah. for Portuguese standards, guys, if there's anything that takes more than ten minutes walk, people will drive it. People do not like to walk in this country it's true, yeah. because of the heat, which is understandable. But you know, for, for us, we're fine. Well, uh, uh, apart from Charlotte, so she's a bit red, you know. And she's saying she's only red because because we're underneath a red umbrella, basically. Wait, let me cope, all right? <laughs>
smells strong. I, I think it'll. <laughs> let's I think see. You, ha you have to down it, okay? No, yeah. Down it. Okay. One, two, three. It's actually it's all really right. nice. It's alright. Oh, it's going to be horrific. It's, it's actually right. really good. It is strong, but it's not super strong. There's the aftertaste. I feel it going down. Um, can I have some food, Mom? It's not food. You don't want it. Yeah, you, you don't want it, buddy. But you gave me cucumber and lettuce today. No, you don't want this. Neither of you want this. Yes, alcohol. You guys can't have it. <laughs> Proceeds to, to, to eat hand. <laughs> hey, guys. We're just walking in. This is a different village from what we usually go to. Um, it's one of the local ones. You can't walk through it. Look how pretty it looks. I don't know if you can see it on camera. Look, there's the main road and there's like all the lights. So pretty. I can hear all the music. We can hear the music all the way from our house and it's so far away, but I'm really excited. Um, it's already dark, but these usually go on to 2 a.m. in the morning. Gold fryer. All right, lads, we're at the party. This is the most bizarre thing I've ever witnessed in my life, right? They are going to do an auction for like someone's neighbor's van that someone's going to pay money for, but there's comes with a goat. Called like no there is an actual goat in there called Noah. It's so funny. I've never seen anything like it. Okay, it's a lamb actually. And I was a bit when I heard that suddenly there was a lamb, I was a bit worried. Yeah, like right. it's in a cage, well, well, and I've looked at it, and it's literally just getting fed treats, and it's having the All best the time. time yeah. So don't feel bad for it. It's, it's doing okay. The auctions at twenty euros so far. Twenty five euros for a van and a goat. No, just a goat. Fifty. Fifty for the goat. No lamb. Lamb. Sorry, lamb. God, I'm, I've had too many beers, but yeah, lamb for fifty euros. <laughs> let, let me know if that's a good price for a lamb in the comments. Oh, that's a very good price for a lamb. <laughs> So 
Oh, and there was a big warning saying that accidents regularly happen on this road, so, so I feel super comfortable right now. Yeah, 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 yeah. right. <laughs> you guys see? Hola everybody, Hola. bon dia. I am finally going to do, clean all the hay in the front of the house. To be fair, in poo. my defense, I did go to do it and I just ended up whacking my head and having to go to the hospital. So that is a pretty good defense, <laughs> to be fair. And since then we've put it off because it is not a very nice job, but yeah. it really, really does need doing. We've decided most of it is probably going to end up in the- Compost. Yeah, because it's just rank. But I did buy some lettuce. All of our lettuce was used up and I need to put some more in the garden. So I bought a couple of little lettuce just to guess through. And also, Charlotte's gonna harvest the corn. <gasps> corn! It's corn! It's corn! Yeah, some of it's ready. I'm really excited. Yeah. It looks really good. I had a little peek. Mm. Pulled its little, its little top down. That sounds really... Anyway, okay. it looks really good. Oh, before we forget as well, I've got more good news. So we went to deliver penne to a great family um, which day yesterday. did we go? We were, were going to film this part yesterday, but on the way back, it was a bit of a drive. Yeah. We had some like meat in a restaurant. It was hot. And then the meat heat combo equals nap. So we didn't feel like We anything. just got back home and it was like, you know what? It's 34 degrees, 35, you just nap. Yeah. But the same people loved Penny so much that w that everyone in the village like started chatting. They said, "Oh, these lovely people have this this other dog." So now we have to go back there on Saturday. Mm -hmm. We'll deliver um, yeah. ravioli. Ravioli. The boy, he's going to. Home. I want. Carlos has a soft spot. I, for, uh, yeah. I had a soft spot for, for Penny. She loves cuddling yeah. with me. Ravioli loves cuddling with Carlos. So yeah. we're both gonna. But then they get to see each other because they're friends, so mm -hmm. that's yeah. nice. Uh, and it's near a, a natural pool, isn't a it? River beach. They've got a yeah. big river beach there, and they both love playing in water, so it's it's quite nice setup, yeah. really. So now we just need to find a good home for Tagliatelli, guys. If you know of anyone, if you are interested in a rascal puppy, she loves belly rubs. She, does. <laughs> she has the best recall of any puppy she does. to to be fair and she is very intelligent she can she's do sit turn and she can do up already so yeah. she's a very smart dog she just needs to keep herself busy yeah yeah, yeah. um yeah she loves a ball she mm -hmm. loves a good ball <gasps> well you stay in here buddy don't worry <laughs> <laughs> right let's get into the garden let's go get into the garden yeah um I'm gonna go get some corn. I think I'm gonna start with the corn. I'm so start excited. with the corn. I'm yeah. so excited. Yeah. I have no idea how you pull these off. I've never pulled one of these off before. I presume you just. Carlos, any idea how you yank one of these off? This is the one I checked yesterday. <gasps> please be good, please be good. I checked the top. Oh, we've got one mold, we've got one moldy kernel. Just one. She's looking quite good. She is looking good. Let's just pull pull all your layers back. Let's have a look. Let's have a look. Please be good. I really want some corn. We've got ramen tonight. I think some nice fresh corn on my ramen. <laughs> First time 
growing it. And lads, I've absolutely smashed it. There's a couple at the end here. But for the most part, she's looking fresh. Oh, oh, oh. oh Carlos, this, this corn looks so good. That's a pretty good, for a first one. That's one that I hand pollinated. I did some of them hand pollinated and I'll be honest, I forgot to do the rest. Um, so we'll see what, what the rest are like. I'm pretty happy with that. Hi buddy, look what I've got. Where have you got? You cannot eat bunch of grapes. Absolutely not. Yeah, it's all right, I've got them. Yeah. What do you think buddy? <laughs> he doesn't care. <laughs> oh, that's dead anyway. This time. Oh, he's gonna poop right on our onions. Yeah, thank you. Tortellini. Oh, <laughs> we've let the puppies out for a run because we're both sides of the house. Hello. <laughs> so we can keep an eye on them and do a little bit of recall whilst they're young. I'm gonna have to move my basket up, aren't I? Yes, I am, because you're all chaos. Bird feather sausage. That corn looks like a bang, isn't Looking good. I think the ants got into a couple of these. Nah. Rascals, what are you doing there? Just going into. Uh, uh, uh. So I have to put them in, I think. Yeah, they go a bit mad sometimes, don't yeah. they? She's found the courgettes. Uh, uh, uh. The girl loves a courgette. They're not in trouble, sausage. Uh, you can you not find tomatoes, can they? No. This is an old one. I don't think That's they're like one. poisonous. They're just don't not. Come with the chilies, not the chilies. That's a scissor sausage. You can't eat the scissors. Oh, did I leave the scissors out here? These big white ones. Tortellini. This one might be even better. <gasps> oh, that is a beautiful head of corn. Oh my god, no. Stop it. Stop it. There's a couple of little more bits, but. Look at that. Ooh. That is a good little bit of corn, mate. It's corn. I'm so proud. Come on. Why's this one not? Oh. There you go. That one did not want to come off. This one doesn't feel as thick. This is why I hand pollinated some of them. These are the ones that haven't been filled up, but these ones are still good. It smells like corn. Anyway, I'm going to keep harvesting my corn and I'm going to plant some stuff in a second. I'll see you then. <laughs>
Hey guys, thank you so much for watching this week's video. If you guys would are interested in getting this cute little sausage, there you go. Oh, she's doing funny puppy now. She's really big now. What do you think, Daddy? Daddy? So yeah, she's very cuddly, so sleepy. <laughs> if you want to get her a home, just let us know, okay? Chelsea.